Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Millgap Farms. Thanks for taking time out of your day to watch our video. Today, we are down at the pumpkin patch. It's a volunteer pumpkin patch on our farm. I uh, don't really know how it got here, but it's hey, here, and now we have pumpkins. Hey, Come here, little buddy. What? You got your screwdriver? Yeah. Look at yourself in the picture. You see yourself on the camera? Yeah. So what are we going to do? Pick pumpkins? Yeah. No, we're not. We're just going to look at a couple of things, okay? Today, guys, we're going to talk about uh, nightshade. It's a very dangerous plant. If it's in your pastures, you need to get rid of it immediately. So thanks again for watching. If you like what you see, show me a thumbs up. Give me a thumbs up, buddy. I like this. I like this. I like this. Give me a camera. Thumbs up. Okay. If you guys like what you're seeing, give us a thumbs up. Yeah. If you guys like what you're seeing, definitely give us a thumbs up. Uh, share it, comment. Uh, we appreciate the comments. If there's something that you think we could do a video on, let us know. Um, we really appreciate the time you take to watch our videos. The little man says we got to go into the pumpkin patch. So let's go check out that nightshade. So right here, guys, is what we call nightshade, or what is called nightshade. It comes out um, towards the middle, uh, end of July into August, usually when it's a little drier out. And the way you can tell it's nightshade is this. See the green leaf? You flip that leaf over, it's purple. There are no spikes on this plant at all. And this thing is very dangerous, okay? Very, very dangerous. The difference in this and some other plants that we'll show you in a minute is that this doesn't have any spikes on it whatsoever. Now this time of year, you're gonna start seeing some purplish flowers that come off of it. They're white. Well, here's, here's a white one right here. There you go. See that flower? They're tiny. So what's, what concerns me about this plant is that it's been eaten already. And so there's a chance that one of my animals have eaten it. It only takes about this much right here to kill a sheep, a goat, and this will even kill cattle if it's eaten in sufficient quantities. The plant is dangerous in any state. So in the pasture, it's dangerous the way you see it. It's dangerous when you make it into hay. In whatever you see it, it is dangerous. Or whatever, in whatever manner the animal consumes it, it's dangerous. So it's either dried or in its natural state the way it is in our pasture now. So what we're going to do with this particular plant is we're going to pull it out of the ground. Comes up pretty easily. Get all those little roots. Wow, Holy cow. You guys see this? Whoa, that's a big. That's the root ball, okay? Okay. I want to get all of it out of here. I'm going to put it on the fence for the moment. We're going to walk around the pasture and see if we see any more of these. That's What do you see, Gabriel? Is that a, is that a crazy plant? Yeah. All right, let's look around. You see any more? It looks like it. Yeah. In this area where we are, there's a bunch of spiky plants, yeah, yeah. and they're no good. Here's another one right here. What? No. Now look at this plant, guys. What? It looks kind of purple here, but that's not purple underside of the leaf. It's green. Plus, it has spikes. Uh -huh. That's this plant's defense against animals trying to eat it. It's a, it's definitely a weed, but it's not a weed that's going to kill them. Everything I'm seeing in our pumpkin patch yeah. is pumpkins. I don't see any more nightshade. What? That's the only one. If you guys look at it now, look at it on the... Uh... You see how purple that thing looks like? Wow. Easy to, un easy to discern when you get it up in the air. You found puppy? That pasture right over there, guys, where the waterer is, has been checked for nightshade. Uh, this pasture has not been checked for nightshade. We're going to be doing that later today. Here are our sheep up here. These are our female sheep. You can see our house up on the hill. There's the sugar barn. And a little natural area over here that we did the video with Jesse and his mulcher. Come on, buddy, let's go up here. We gotta go back towards the barn. 
and that stupid dog right there. By having different animals, such as cows, horses, and cattle in your pasture at the same time, different grasses are eaten down. <laughs> you silly dog just bumped into me. Got the whole pasture to run through and he bumps into me. So that's our hay field. We're gonna be ready to do some hay here in a couple of weeks. We're gonna be moving our sheep over here um, on the pasture here so that they have fresh, clean grass. And every night we'll bring them back in here. But we're gonna need to check this pasture as well. Gotcha. Since we went ahead and bush hog here, I know we don't have any nightshade in there. And we've got a lot of good grasses in there too. Guys, this is the plant that I originally thought could have been nightshade because it is all over our pastures. Um, the difference is, if you can see it, it's got spikes on it. And it also has berries. There'll be little yellow berries that are that'll appear on it. This one has green berries and purple underneath the side of the leaf. This is green underneath the leaf with spikes. So this plant is nightshade as you can see now it's starting to wilt. This is the nightshade plant here. Yeah, it's a snake. There's no snakes here. Thanks for visiting Milgat Farms today guys. We appreciate you taking time as always to watch our videos. The kids and I are sitting on the garden bench next to the house. What a beautiful day it is here. If you like uh, what you're seeing, give us a thumbs up. Isabel, can you show what a thumbs up looks like? Right there, huh? Good job, Is. Again, thanks for watching our videos. God bless you guys. Can you say subscribe to our video? Subscribe to our video and love, subscribe to our video. Can you look right here? Say subscribe to our video. Subscribe to our video below. Can you say share it? Share Say subscribe to our video. Okay, try again. Um, we'll turn the yellow and, and thumbs up. Get it. Thumbs up. All right.